this video, I'm going to show you a tactic that we use to double our response rates to cold outreach. Of course, I'm talking about multi-channel outreach. One channel isn't enough anymore, right? Some people will never reply to your cold email, no matter how good it is and how relevant it is. And some people will never reply to your LinkedIn message just because it's just not active on LinkedIn. So it's not a choice anymore. You have to do both, but it's not simple to do multi-channel outreach because in 2024, if you have to do cold email, you have to use a tool like Instantly AI. Instantly AI has been on a tier with over 10,000 customers using them, particularly cold email agencies who've fallen in love with them. And for good reason, there are two reasons. Reason number one, deliverability. Cold emails often go to spam and instantly has a very good email warm-up technology that makes sure that your cold emails, you know, definitely don't land in spam. That's number one. Number two is the cost, right? They allow you to attach unlimited, unlimited email accounts without breaking the bank for a fixed cost. They obviously charge you more if you have more sending volume across those accounts. With these two key features, Instantly has been on a tier and is loved by over 10,000 agencies. But it has a big missing feature, right? Which is LinkedIn. I'll tell you why you're leaving money on the table if you're just using Instantly. Because even if you're running a very successful cold email campaign, you're only going to have a 5-10% to 10 response rate. Which means that 90-95% to 95 of the people that you're reaching out to will never reply to you on cold email. Which means that if you have a 100% list you know out of those 9 to 95 you're just not touching enough right you're just touching them on email three or four times and then you're leaving them alone while on linkedin what you could do is for the people who haven't responded to your instantly campaign you could automatically enroll them into linkedin and then try to get in touch with them that way and we have a way to do that let's get into it in this video i'm going to i'm going to show you our zapier template about how we enroll all of the people who have not replied to our instantly campaign into an automated LinkedIn uh, connection request and follow up campaign on a tool called sales robot so that you don't have to do anything. You're able to automatically enroll those leads into a LinkedIn campaign if they don't reply to your cold email. So let's get right into it. Let's see how it's set up. So the step number one in that zap is new event and instantly. So in this, the event is going to be email sent. So we're going to trigger it on every email that is sent, but obviously you only want to continue if that email is the final email right so what we've done is we want to see if the step matches exactly one and for us it was a step one campaign because we just had one step in the email just for uh, a demo purpose but for you let's say you have a five step email sequence then the number here should be five right because you want to trigger only if the email is the last email right that's the first thing so it was this particular campaign that we ran this campaign and it's completed and we just sent uh, two emails right that's number one. Now we want to wait for a few days, right? Before actually sending them to LinkedIn because that person might reply, you know, in a few days. So you can just de uh, decide how many days you want to wait after the final email. Let's say I want to wait for, you know, um, three days, right? And then enroll them into a LinkedIn campaign. And finally, let's say I don't have their, you know, LinkedIn ID. So we use a tool called reverse contact to take the email ID and try to find their LinkedIn uh, URL using a tool called reverse contact. So you can just set up your account in reverse contact action. You know, you're just uh, putting the email address. So you just map it via instantly. So you just put in leads email in here and that's it. And then you can test and it will give you, uh, yeah. So it will give you action, continue, test, and this will give you their LinkedIn URL if it finds it, right? Yeah, so it's now given me the LinkedIn URL of this guy. And yeah, so it becomes a easy enough way to map out the LinkedIn URL. You don't need this step if you actually have this data in instantly because instantly will give you that LinkedIn URL. For me, I didn't have it. So I just, you know, found the LinkedIn URL using reverse contact. Now, once all of this is done, we want to send that contact to a sales robot campaign. Then we just need to go to sales robot, create an account, create a campaign and enroll all of those people into a campaign. So let me show you how to do that real quick. So number one, you go to sales robot and then you set up something called a campaign, right? Because you want to reach out to the same people, but on LinkedIn. So once you add your account, it's, it's a simple cloud-based tool. You just connect your LinkedIn credentials, just like, you know, you do in any other tool. You click on create campaign, click on I'm advanced user. Let's say, you know, you want to do it. Um, CSV import, you know, hit save. And just add, uh, you know, from a CSV to start the campaign. But for the purpose of this demo, I can just show you how it would look from a LinkedIn search. Hit save. And then step number two is going to be setting up the sequence, right? 
So now you want to send them a connection request first, you know, with something like send you a few emails. Did you get a chance to check them? Right, something like that. And then once that's done, you hit save and then add step after, send message once they connect with you. I first name and then here is where you do like a soft pitch or whatever, right? You, you know how to do copywriting if you're using instantly. They've got good training around it. So yeah, you can set up the sequence this way and just click on start campaign. Once you do that, you just remember the name of the campaign and put it inside the Zapier zap here. So here, once you go here, go to action, go to URL. So this is the URL that you need to find for your account. So the way you do that is go to sales robot, um, go to the account that you've connected, settings, integrations, and click on sales robot, enable the webhook endpoints, and you have to use this URL endpoint called add prospect to a campaign. And you need three things. You need the campaign name, first name, and the profile URL of that person. So you go back to Zapier, you set up um, this URL, right? And payload type would be JSON. Profile URL comes from the identifier, right? From uh, this person, reverse email contact here. Yeah, if it finds the, the URL, you just map the URL, right? Like that's the way to do it. Yeah, person LinkedIn identifier would come up here. Now, first name would be Abhishek. Campaign name would be what we just copied, which is CSV import, right? So we just put that campaign name here. And make sure you're putting the campaign name exactly like it is on Sales Robot. Otherwise, it wouldn't match. Once you've done all of this, uh, you just go to Zapier, set it up, and unflatten yes, content type application JSON, leave all of it as is, and just click continue, right? So once you do that, that's it, right? You just click on publish and then what will happen is all the people in your instantly campaigns that are not replying to your emails, even after let's say three days, will automatically get enrolled into a LinkedIn sequence and you will double your response rates overnight. So that's how this works. Give it a try and let me know if you get better results. I'm sure you would. All right, so that's it from me on this video. If you guys want any more help with Zapier automations or getting more leads, definitely reach out to me, leave a comment and I'll get back to you. All right, that's it for me in this video.